Hey, good morning, everyone. Towards the end of this month, I am going to be concluding the contest I have right now. Hurry up, subscribe to my channel. Only takes a second, so you can be eligible to win the Sea Reader 4001 computer scanner for your vehicle, along with a rock block, which is your tailgate seal. That's that rubber membrane that seals the gap between the end of your tailgate and the bed of your truck. To be eligible, you must subscribe to the channel, though. So please take a moment, subscribe to my channel, and get your name in the hat. Thanks, everyone. Hey everybody, so we have a Roomba, which is a robot vacuum cleaner for our home. We got it about three or four years ago. I think we paid about five or six hundred dollars for the specific model that we have. You know, we really just let it do its thing at night. We hit the start button and let it vacuum the house and do its basic cleaning of our house while we're sleeping, and then it returns back to its docking station when it's done to recharge. We've had pretty good luck with it. You know, it doesn't pick up every little thing on the floor and it doesn't get to every little spot, but it does a pretty good job of picking up just any of that small bits of dirt that you may track in, or if you have any animals, um, we have a couple cats and it picks up some of the cat fur that you get on the floor sometimes. Well, we wanted something similar for our fifth wheel because sometimes we go out and we take hikes and we track in dirt, dust, sand, debris, stuff into the RV that you're not always able to wipe off your feet real well, especially if you have children or any type of dogs or cats. What's very ironic is that not a day after my wife asked me if I could look into getting a robot vacuum cleaner for our fifth wheel, I received an email from a company called GearBest that has an entire portfolio of products that are kind of suited for RVers as well as just general home electronic use. What was even more ironic about this email is that they were specifically asking me to try to pick a few products from their portfolio or their catalog that would be targeted towards people who live or use recreational vehicles. So that was interesting to me. I kind of saw it as a sign. I looked at their website and I'll provide the link in the description below. And what shocked me was simply the vast array of stuff that they offer through their website. It's pretty amazing that just sheer number of electronic devices that they have, including a whole assortment of robot vacuum cleaners. Anyways, we ended up getting an iLife robot vacuum cleaner. They shipped it out. It got to us very quickly. I think maybe three or four days after we ordered it, it came to us. And I tested it around my home, which I'll show you some video of now, and just to see how it would perform compared to our Roomba. Now, one of the unique features that this vacuum has that I honestly didn't even see in the description is that it also acts as a mop. You can fill a little water reservoir inside and put the mopping attachment to it and it will go around and actually mop your home. We didn't actually get around to testing the mopping feature mainly because with the size of the reservoir we really didn't believe that it would do that great of a job mopping the house. It may have surprised us but it probably wouldn't have. Instead we plan on using that feature more so in the RV especially considering how much smaller it is and how much less effort it's going to have to really do to do an adequate job sweeping and mopping the RV. Now, if you go to their website, you're gonna see that they have a huge portfolio of consumer electronics, from smartwatches to tire pressure monitoring systems to a vast array of robot vacuum cleaners and portable refrigerators, all sorts of different things that you may find very, very useful in your RV lifestyle or even at your home. Now we've only had this vacuum for a relatively short period of time, so I haven't been able to test it in the RV yet, but we do plan on taking the RV out very soon. And I want to do a full test inside of the RV, especially, you know, after we track some sand, dirt, dust, whatever inside of there, as well as check on the mopping feature, because that's going to be a very interesting one for me. Anyways, guys, I'll put the link in the description of my video. If you want to go take a look at the stuff that they have, like I said, they have a huge assortment of vacuum cleaners, so you have quite a few to choose from. We just kind of picked the one that looked the coolest to us, but they all probably function relatively the same. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you do, I'd appreciate it if you give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thanks, everyone.